What is going on, guys? Fetty Big Guy 62 here, yet bringing you another commentary. And I know it's been a while since I've done one or done a video, period. But I've had a lot of family issues go on. Family issues that I'm talking about, some of my friends know, some of, you know, my subscribers know, but not very many of them do. And when I say this is my wife's mother had a stroke. And when I say she had a stroke, it put her in the hospital. And she was in the hospital for, well, actually, she's still in the hospital now. She's just, she's in a different part of the hospital. Now she's in the rehab for, you know, like speech therapy, stuff like that, making sure her muscle function works, her speech function works, stuff like that. She's got to stay there for 20 days. But other than that, that's what's been going on with me. This right here is a gameplay of some hard point on Nuketown from a while back. Like probably 100 levels ago or something like that. I'm using the Weevil, I think it's got... Not sure if it had... I know it's got extended mag on it, but I can't remember if it was the rapid fire one. Oh, it's got long barrel and extended mag. It's basically all I run on it. Sometimes it'll be stock, but... That's what's been going on with me. You know, I'm sorry that I haven't posted as much as I should have, but I have to be there to, you know, comfort my family, you know, in a time of need like that. But that, in my opinion, was more important than doing a video. You know, I hate to say it, but... You know, family comes first, no matter what. You know, sometimes they'll fuck you over, sometimes they won't. But, you know, if you've never had to deal with, you know, losing somebody like, say, a parent, grandparent, you know, brother, sister, anything like that, you don't never know how to take it whenever, you know, say if it's your spouse or, you know, your dad or mother or something like that. Say one of their parents dies or something like that. You you don't know how to take it. You know, basically the only thing you can do is comfort them the best way possible. You know, whether it be, you know, just basically being there for them to where, you know, try to take their mind off of it. So, you know, they don't they don't feel the pain and the hurt that they're caught. But needless to say, her mom didn't die or whatever, but you know, it's still good for you know, for me to be there for my wife. Because a little bit over a year ago, you know, she lost her dad. Which I know it sucks, but I mean it, it's life. I mean it's gonna happen. People don't want it to happen, but it's going to happen. I mean, you can't be scared of it. If you're scared of it, you're going to live your whole life, you know, thinking of when it's going to happen or how it's going to happen, blah, blah, blah. I'll put it like this. If it's my time to go, it's my time to go. Period. But, I mean, it's just, there's been a lot of shit going on. I mean, this video is going to be a little bit longer than normal. I think it's going to be like a little bit at like, like right at 10, 11 minutes, something like that. But, you know, I just want y'all to know what's been going on, stuff like that. I've been in the slums on Call of Duty, just to let y'all know that too. But it's just... Something that... I, I stopped having fun playing. You know, once I hit the the Prestige Master level 200 and something, and once, you know, I got Dark Matter, it kind of got boring. I mean, yeah, they supposedly got the new game modes out. Or the game mode, or whatever the hell it was called. Fracture, or whatever. But, 
you know, I, I haven't played it in probably over a month. Well, actually, well over a month. I haven't played Call of Duty. I've been playing Destiny. I've been having more fun on Destiny. And just because there's a lot more stuff to do on Destiny. I mean, you got three characters, 335, once it hits... You know, I think the name of it's going to be The Rise of the Iron or something like that. The, ne the next DLC that's coming out in September for Destiny. And there's just stuff that still got to be done in it. You know, I have to hit a 335, you know, to be raid ready for the next one. Or close to being raid ready for the next one. Because I think right now I'm sitting on a like 334 on my Warlock. You know, if people that, you know, watch my channel play Destiny, you know what I'm talking about. You know, 335, you got Hunters, Warlocks, Titans, stuff like that. It's just, you know, a lot of grinding to do and stuff like that. But, I mean, it's just part of the game. I mean, you do the same thing in Call of Duty. You know, you grind out your levels, prestiges, you know, doing weapons and stuff like that. It's basically the same thing. It's just people have their own aspect of how to do it. You know, whether it be, you know, a solo or in a party. I mean, people just do it differently. I mean, some people might not like Destiny. Some people do. Some people don't. But, I mean, as like I said before in, like, different game gameplay, you know, there's games that appeal people that don't appeal to me. But... I've been having a lot more fun playing Destiny than I have Call of Duty. But I say that, and the gameplay in the background is a Black Ops 3 gameplay on Nuketown. And it's just, like I said, a slums in Call of Duty. Because it's after, like I said, you get dark matter and you're like prestige master, so whatever. It's kind of, there's really nothing else to do. I mean, I don't have luck getting the guns. I have almost every melee weapons except for like the newest ones. And I don't plan on getting them dark matter. Just because I hated doing the... The combat knife. Hated it. Dreaded it. With passion. But, I mean, that's just part of the game. I mean, you grind out to get a certain camo. You do this to get certain guns. I don't have any of the, the only, like, the newest gun that I got was the L4 Siege and the RSA Interdiction. I don't have the MX Garand or the FFAR or the HG40 or the Banshee or the Rift 9 or anything like that. I just, just, my look for that just is shit. You know, my RNG sucks. You know, I got, I got people on my friends list that's got every damn gun in the game, basically. But it's like, I, it seems that I can't get it. At all. But shit happens. I mean, you, you do stuff to try to get it and stuff like that, but I mean, some things you'll never get. Oh, uh, it's like me. I, di I didn't think I'd ever get Dark Matter. But seven months into the game, I finally got it. And I figured since mainly what y'all have always watched on my channel has been, you know, Either hardcore TDM, TDM, domination, something like that. I figured I'd switch it up, you know, different game mode. You know, yeah, sometimes it's a little campy just because it's, you know, a, it's hard point. I mean, you try to go for the heel, try to, you know, keep the heel as long as you can. And, you know, that's how you win, but... There's just 
stuff that comes before you got it's like you got to get your priorities straight because you know sometimes say whether it be you know family comes first no matter what and with my wife working on the weekends now it's kind of harder for me to do videos because i got my little boy which i mean i have him every weekend i mean me and my wife's not split up or anything like that it's just I really haven't had the time in the last couple of weeks or the last month or so to actually do one because of all the stuff that's been going around or going down with rather it be, you know, stuff with her mom or something like that. But, you know, I'm glad that, you know, the subscribers that I got still stick around, you know, Watch my videos, stuff like that. You know, I thank y'all for that. And you know, if it wasn't for y'all, I think I'd probably be done with YouTube. But I mean, it's a trial and error thing. You you learn from your mistakes. But. Thank y'all for sticking around. This is your boy Fatty Big Guy 62, and we'll see y'all on the next one.